I know, I'm never on camera. Um, this is uncomfortable. <laughs> so, um, I've done Nuzlocke's before. I've never finished one. The Elite Four is gonna be weird. And, yeah. Uh, that, that's about it. You're caught up. I'm playing this on my GameCube. Because I'm just a sucker for original hardware. Like, this probably wasn't the best one to start with. But I'm also a sucker for, uh, going in order. Also, I think I might, uh, give uploading daily on YouTube a rest for a bit. Because, hooey, I, uh, I kind of lost two subscribers and that kind of hit me hard. Give me a random number between one and three. Three. Bulbasaur, my favorite one. I don't know why he's all the way on the right. So, um, I have this habit of whenever I play the Gen 1 games and I get a Bulbasaur, I always name it Zor after, um, the Venusaur of K6 Scope from his Pokemon Yellow playthrough. Just exactly what he called himself when we talked to him, Zor. He said, Bulba, Zor! But yeah, I, I, I'm pretty sure Bulbasaur is gonna be the easy mode. But we have a potion, so we should be fine. Monzor, you can take him. Don't die. Oh, oh, so he gets a critical? <laughs> hey, Pencil Gun, how's it going? Oh, thank you for following. That's so nice. There, I don't think that played the first time. I have no idea, actually. Man, this is the closest first battle I've ever had in my life. That's fun. We can be like rivals. Assuming you just started. Or else this can be a one-sided rivalry. Ooh, do we change it to set to make it harder? Yeah, we do. I'm cocky enough. Alrighty. <laughs> I've been re-watching the show on, like, I bought a CRT for retro gaming. And mainly what I've been doing is just watching the Pokemon anime. I've played through, like, all the games. Probably, like, at least five times each. So hopefully I do well. No items in battle set and your Pokemon cannot be a higher level. Jeez, that is that's that's a lot of a lot of stipulations. I'm not sure if I could do that. I mean my Pokemon probably won't be as high as the gym leader just because I'm against grinding. But if I were to grind, I would want it to be really cheap. I got really scared for a second because I thought Gust was flying type, but I forgot this game's kind of garbage. Really hard. Yeah, I believe it. That sounds painful. <laughs> Especially if you get to the Elite Four, because that, that's a lot of battles. Usually I need to be like 10 levels over to win. I'm not very good at Pokemon. <laughs> the first Pokemon, I, Pokemon game I beat on my own without any like external help was... Pokemon X and Y. And those games are like notoriously evil. So I know it says evil. Like, I clearly say evil, but I definitely meant easy. Just so you all know. I will be in Lavender Town. When you return. I feel like that's a curse. But alright, enjoy your Taco Bell. I just load up another save file that's in Lavender Town, really freak him out. I've never grabbed the town map from her in any game. He's always like, I'll, I'll tell her not to give you one, but who needs one? It's not that, like, difficult of a region. <laughs> you know what sucks? Um, they don't, like, confirm or not whether or not you want to delete a move. And there's, like, whenever I played Crystal on stream, I accidentally deleted Razor Leaf on my Bay Leaf. Yay, Autumn learned Poison Powder. Da, 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 da. Again, oh wrong God. on that effect. Um. What? Um. Um. Okay, what's um? Oh my God, you got rid of Razor Leaf. Ah! I'm so sorry. Oh my God, sense. it doesn't get another grass type move to level 50! And that sucked. Because, like, obviously I was mashing buttons because I didn't want to deal with it. Not my greatest uh, achievement. Man, the 
The GameCube D-pad is my least favorite thing. It's just so, like, mushy. Like, I don't like that on the, uh, Game Boy Advance, either. At all. Like, everyone says the wide Game Boy is better, but I hard disagree on that. That is not a true statement. <laughs> the SP is so much better. Yeah, we can just take, like, ten. Or buy an antidote, obviously. That's... That's a no-brainer. I do not want to die from poison. We should probably get the Route 1 Pokemon. I'm praying it's a Pidgey. I'm also gonna do, um, Dupe's Claws, so I cannot catch another Pidgey after this. Oof, that almost killed him. Alright, we got him. Chat, what should I name my Pidgey? Uh, bird. There we go. You know, some people in Nuzlocke like, restrict the amount of times they can go to a Pokemon Center. And like, why would you want to do that? That just seems awful. I don't know, people come up with the weirdest Pokemon challenges and like, I respect it. I just don't want to do it. I'm gonna turn down the game volume just a smidgen. Like, halfway down so that it doesn't overtake my voice. Because my voice is not very, uh, high. And not get it up the volume. Let's see. So there should be an item up here. My cat wants to come in one second. Hello. Say hi to everyone. I'm back with a cat under my desk. So there's a rival fight beyond here. I'm just not gonna touch it yet because I'm terrified. He's gonna have a Spearow and the Charmander. They're gonna be like level nine each. A Rattata, great. The two Route One Pokemon. I don't know. I can probably catch it, right? That is a high catch rate. Someone messaged me on Discord. Okay, I might have a co-commentator. Oh no, it didn't catch. Oops. I may have to kill it. It'll be a merciful kill, don't worry. Never mind, we're good. Because if, if it escaped one more time, I was hitting that tackle button. Man, I really wish I could have done yellow. Because, like, that seems like it would be harder anyway. You know, I could name these Pokemon after my friends. No, I won't. Um, what are raps called? Oh, I know, uh, Ratatouille, baby. I don't know if that's how that's spelled, but that's what we're going with. Okay, how are we gonna grind up these Pokemon? We're gonna have to do a lot of switch training here. And I'm not gonna be happy with that. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get Zor to a point where he can one hit knock out anything. And then we're gonna switch train. That's the strategy so far. Well, life goes on, you know? Actually, I could probably switch train now just because I'm impatient, but in my experience, um, me being impatient is the worst thing I could be. Especially in a Nuzlocke. Like, who? Man, I finally killed it. That only took forever. That's lovely. Level 8, baby. I don't know, maybe we can find a new friend. Maybe Bird won't kill it this time, you know? So what are we hoping for? Um... Honestly, probably Caterpie. I, like, I love Pikachu, but like... It takes so long to get him into Raichu, and I've tried using Pikachu through the entire game, and it's rough. Or we could just not find any Pokemon. That's fine. Does... Okay, I was gonna say, like, does Viridian Forest just not have any Pokemon? It's another Caterpie. Lovely. And Caterpie's caught, baby. Venonat was definitely supposed to be Butterfree's pre-evolution. So we're just gonna name him Venonat. I'm mad. So, Necrozma kept trying to use psychic moves, but obviously the, like, AI couldn't tell that the game was saying it didn't affect whatever. So it couldn't put two and two together, so it just kept reading it as, this is a fighting type, use psychic move. You know? Also, Venonat evolved. Hooray. 
Go Venonat! I like to check chat once in a while, just to like make sure I greet everyone. I think greeting people is a really important part of the stream. In my personal opinion, at least. Okay, so what I think I'm gonna do is just like train Zor up to learning Vine with. Because I don't think I'm gonna stand a chance if I've got a level 10 Bulbasaur that's tackling an Onyx. You know? So Zor, you're coming to the front, buddy. Also, the second I learn Vine Whip, I'm gonna sweep every gym until the third one. But by then I can get, like, if I'm really lucky, I can get a Doug Trio, but... Actually, would that be lucky? Because it's level 30 and it would knock out my Pokémon, so never mind. I got, like, what, 24 experience from that? And I need 630, that- nope. I'm not doing, like... I'm not doing, like, 60 battles, no thank you. Never mind, there's Joy, we're going to the Pokemon gym. <laughs> there's no way I'm doing that. That's too much grinding. Do we grind the others, though? I don't want to. Like, I'm just lazy. <laughs> we could try to buy, like, debuff moves. Or, not debuff moves, but, like, potion. And we could try debuff. Does Leech Seed count as grass damage? I think it does, so I think we should be fine. Nope, it doesn't do a bunch of damage. I thought it would, like, do d more damage than anything's ever done. No, oh, critical hit, really? It's- it's doing 1 HP again. Like, I thought it would do more. Does Leech Seed just always do 1 HP, or is it, like, dependent on my attack? Also, I forgot, critical hits in this game are determined by speed. So that's why Diglett is getting all the critical hits, because it's a faster Pokemon. This is not good. Okay, level 11. No, 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 we don't do that. I'm sending in a level 8 bird. Uh, we're gonna have issues. And this is why you train. But me, I say that grinding is a garbage mechanic. Unfortunately, I'm doing a challenge run, where grinding is a near necessity, I would argue. My lord. I'm- I'm worried. A uh, bird might not make it out of here alive. That's all I'm saying. I mean, it seems to be using sand attack, which I- I thought was a ground type move. So, that shouldn't really be working on a bird. Especially since, like, to fly it needs to flap its wings, which would, like, repel the sand away. But who knows? Okay. No, 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 don't do a lot. Uh, that did an amount of damage. That did eight damage. Oh, and it does- it- it brings back two to bird. I feel like that's favoritism, right? Which means, right now, if he got a critical, I would die. So I'm taking him out, bringing out someone. Benanat, high defense. I can just get off a tackle, I think I should be good. Nope. And there we go. I hope that just gave everyone, like, 72 experience. That's actually good. That worried me a lot. So I'm gonna grind, unfortunately, I know. So I could grind here, but it's also faster to just fight Blue. Also, he goes away after you beat Brock, so might as well fight him now. Okay, Gary. I like how he just, like, paused in his walking animation for a second there. I like how Blue tried to get into the Pokemon League before any badges. I mean, I guess after one badge, but whatever. And out Pidgey. Oh, it's not a uh, thing. I don't think it knows Peck yet. Hopefully not, or else I'm kind of screwed. We definitely need to switch out when Charmander comes out, because I can't, like, sit here and take a beating from a fire type trying to get off a leech seed. Man, I really don't like Sand Attack, because, like, it just feels like whenever your enemy does a sand attack, your your accuracy just drops all the way down. But whenever you use a debuff move like that, they can still hit you 100% of the time. Okay, bird, you're you're in, bud. Because if I if I have low accuracy and low attack, Bulbasaur is just not getting anywhere. So that's a critical hit. I I feel like I'm good. Like I don't think I have to worry really. Yeah, I should be fine. If it gets below, like, 
and health, I'll definitely switch out, but I, I think I'm good. Yeah, I am. Okay, cool. No, Zora didn't level up. Pokemon League has many tough trainers. I'm not getting past the Pokemon League. Like, don't expect it. <laughs> Alright, Brock. So, oh, should I even bother leech seeding his Geodude? I feel like debuffing Onyx would be, like, the number one priority. And I could probably get a knockout on Geodude. I mean, his defense is high, but I'm a level higher. And I've also got Stab, that same type attack bonus. But, like, since Sora is a grass type, it will also, like, do more damage. I'm gonna go for it. Yes, that was absolutely the play. Okay. Um, I could probably get the same thing on Onyx. But if he uses Bind, I'm kind of screwed. Or Bide. That's not good either. So in like two turns, he's gonna unleash a bunch of damage. It's gonna be like double the amount of damage you gave him. So if you do like 80 damage, he'll send back 106. If he lives. But his attack missed, so that's absolutely fine. And now I'm debuffing, so. That's rough, buddy. I kinda feel bad for Onyx, but like... Don't try to kill my Zor. <laughs> oh yeah, I kinda one hit... One hit him, 100%. But oh well. Took you for granted as proof of your victory. Here's the boulder badge. I didn't even need to use the sprinkler. That, that was not a very hard battle. That probably wasn't really the most interesting thing to watch, but... I enjoyed it. I should look up like all the trainer move sets, but I, I think that might be ch <laughs> But I would win. Yeah, I think the lasses all have like the Pokemon or whatever. And then the youngsters have like poison types. Yikes, that's a lot of damage. Yikes, that that is a lot of damage. Bird, you should be doing more damage because you've got the EBs, alright? Zor, you're up for, like, the foreseeable future, buddy. Easy win, except none of my other Pokemon got the experience, except for, like, like, two experience to bird. So that's rough. Man, I gotta get, like, the bike or something right away. So I guess I'll give Ratatouille some light. I'm praying nothing kills him, because I will be so sad. Ratatouille's one of my favorites. <laughs> Okay, Ratatouille, learned quick attack, great, and Bird leveled up. So I think, like, Bird has a lot of defensive EVs, because he is not taking any attacks. But, you know, what I'm not doing is even giving him the chance to die. Because, <laughs> like, his health is getting kind of low there, and I just don't want to deal with that. I mean, I'm sure everyone expected it, but uh, Zor is the MVP right now. Alright. Hi, I like shorts. They're comfy and easy to wear. Who knew? Ratata Versus Ratatouille. Oh, that's level 11. I'm not- nope. Okay, uh, bad news. Bad news is I don't know what I'm doing. The good news is that I had a potion left. Bad news is I need to buy more potion. No, 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 no. Do not do Tail Whip. I'm good, thanks. Or... Level 15, good job, buddy. Oh no. Okay, so if you get stuck in Bind, which is what Ekans has, um, you can't do anything. And if it's faster than you, it will outspeed you and do Bind every single turn it can. So, we may be screwed. Who knows? Or Wrap, sorry. And it does 3 damage. Uh, yay. Yeah, so you can't attack and you can't switch out. So your best bet is to uh pray. Oh no, you can switch out, never mind. Awful. Okay, cool. Uh that's done. Okay, I'm definitely healing after that. Yeah, I don't ever want to deal with that again, actually. That that worried me immensely. Let's fight, because everyone fights in this game. Wild. This entire country has zero chill. Also, I feel like the game is stretched out on my stream. Like, I'm looking at it here and it's in, like, the Game Boy Advance, or the Game Boy Color ratio. But on my stream, it's kind of stretch. I'm not a fan of it, but oh well, what can you do? Uh, we're not fighting. This one, I think, knows Poison Sting, but I should be good to switch in Venonat. So... 
Just to get the chip damage off, I'm gonna use the leech seed. Just to make sure it's not like hiding anything, because it might just be like buffing itself up so it can use poison sting a bunch. Um I'm leech seeding that. And then I'm gonna send out bird. Yeah, because it's trying to get my defense down. And I know that bird is at least a little bulky. Port attack, yikes. Yikes, 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 yikes. Oh right, I was supposed to buy potions, I forgot. Hopefully it doesn't get another critical. Use Leer again. You love you, Leer. Okay, whatever. It's dead. It's good. We're clear. And now Zor's gonna evolve. So if Zor wasn't already the powerhouse, he is now. Absolute monster at this stage. Um, if I remember correctly, this guy down here does not have strong Pokemon. I'm not wearing shorts, so oh no. God forbid. Oh, never mind, he has, like, garbage Pokemon. Pokemon that could still hurt, though. Which is why we sent out Zor. Man, I never knew what was up with, uh... Ivysaur's back sprite. Like, the one part, all the way to the left, looks like a tail. Like, what is that supposed to be? I don't get it. Also, this, this Spearow is level 14. Which I'm kind of intimidated by. Oh, it, it knows Peck. That's not good. Nope. Backing out. <coughs> Run is dead. Run is dead. Dude, that does so much damage! <laughs> it runs dead. We're done here. Come on. Come on. Just get a critical. Please, bird. This one time. Please. Please. Come on. Come on. Nope. Nope. Doesn't do it. No 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 get a crit come on bird bird it's one health away they're gonna make me make the sacrifice play I'm gonna need to sacrifice Ratatouille Maybe I don't So if I send out Ratatouille and Ratatouille gets wiped out immediately I gotta send out Venonat But Venonat's not fast enough to outspeed it But if there, there's a chance that Ratatouille doesn't get killed, right? But if I sacrifice Venonat, then I know I can get a hit off with Ratatouille. I don't want to trade lives! Okay, you know quick attack? Go. Forgot to buy potions. Why this happening? It, it used Leer. Alright, we don't trade lives, baby. Now it's dead. Thank god. That was, that was scary. Yikes. We do not trade lives at all. Okay, I'm getting potions, I gotta remember. That, that, that kind of terrified me, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, bird, good job, buddy. Oh, bird learned quick attack, okay, cool. That's better than Gus. I hope it doesn't no tackle, because that would suck. No, it doesn't. Okay. Um, the Zor is probably the best one for a Metapod. Zor is just carrying the team. Like, if Zor dies, like, it'll be heartbreaking. Zor is the leader, like, Gust is Zor's best- or not Gust. I should name my Pidgey Gust. That would've been cute. Uh, Bird is Zor's best friend. Ratatouille's just trying to, like, prove himself and stuff. Venonat's, like, the baby of the group. My voice is getting, like, audibly tired, if anyone can hear that. They probably can, actually. Okay, that- that girl has a Jigglypuff, and I don't trust it. Like, I do not like it. I'm definitely getting a Leech Seed off, because I don't know if I can, like- Oh, it doesn't want to use- I mean, I'm not gonna argue with that. That's fine. Don't use sing. And exactly two hours in, I know my Pokémon. Wait, do I have enough money for the Magikarp? I'm thinking about that now. Shoot. Um, you, sir, I would like to buy a fish. Oh my lord. I'm a mess. Alright, um, two hours in, I'm gonna end it. Thank you all so much for hanging out. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. I don't know if I feel like it. I'll stream tomorrow. Okay, uh, bye.